everybody and welcome back to my channel or hi hello if you are new here and thank you for joining me for today's video. Today's video is going to be a new in home bargains haul. I popped in there today and I've picked up mainly cleaning and beauty bits. So I have quite a lot to get through, I actually have it in a Primark bag. Um, so let's just get into it. I'm going to go in no particular order, it's going to be very very random. The first thing that I've got is this big bag of microfiber towels. This is huge, there's 20 in here and it was £4.99. And I got these for two different reasons. I got them for cleaning, but I also got them for washing my own face, which I know they're a cleaning product, but they are obviously just microfiber cloths. And I love using microfiber cloths to wash my face. Now I have a few that I've had for a while and they probably need to go in the bin now. So I wanted to get some new ones. But when you buy ones that are kind of marketed towards skincare and facial things and stuff like that, they're more expensive. It's exactly the same stuff. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to get these and try them out. And these will last me for ages because there's so many in there. But I just obviously need to make sure that I don't mix up the ones that I clean with and the ones that I clean my face with. So I think I'm just going to basically choose two colours, one, two colours for cleaning and two colours for washing my face. And let me just show you them. So this is what one looks like and honestly this is just perfect for washing my face. I just love them so much, they're so soft, they take your makeup off really really easily and they wash up very nice as well. So I think I'm going to keep the purple and blue, or should I use the blue? No, I'm going to use the purple and orange just because I feel like orange will actually blend in my foundation <laughs> into it. Because the main thing that happens like with my other ones, they're white. And after like washing my makeup off for so many times with them, they do start getting that little bit of a, a stain to them. So I'm quite glad that these are coloured. So yeah, I think I'm going to use the orange ones and the purple ones for my face. And then I'm going to use the yellow and blue for cleaning but yeah I've got so many of them now I don't really need this many for cleaning either but they also obviously clean very nicely as well polishing windows cleaning anything really you can use them wet dry um, but yeah I've got 20 here for 4 99 so a really really good price and definitely dual use I'm gonna get a lot of use out of them I shouldn't run out for a while okay next up sorry bringing the wedding into this video as well as all my other videos I've been in for the last few months I feel like I've not done one video where I've not mentioned that I'm getting married I'm gonna mention it again I picked up this from Home Bargains it is just obviously as you can see a little bride wallet thing um, I just really wanted this well it's described as a cosmetic bag um, I don't really need a cosmetic bag, all my makeup and skincare, I've got bags for them already and boxes and stuff, they're very organised already. But I thought this would be lovely to pop my passport in and any travel documents, anything that I've got that is going to be, that I'm going to need when I'm away and anything to do with the wedding, stuff like that. I just thought this would be really handy to have and it's quite nice that it says bride on it. And I also just wanted to buy it because it said bride on it and I thought what can I use this for? And then I realised the passport would fit perfectly in here and I don't have a passport holder. They had quite a nice range of bridal things in there and I thought the colouring was also really nice, like this lovely cream colour with gold writing on it. I thought it looked quite expensive, like it didn't look too cheap from Home Bargains, if you get what I mean. And this cosmetic bag was £2.99. And then actually, sticking with that theme, um, I did show in my last video that I bought a couple of compact mirrors, but they were only like Mother of the Bride and Father of the Bride ones, because I didn't have any that I could personalise towards my friends that are coming. We are travelling abroad if you don't already watch my videos, so there is just a few of us going. Um, but I wanted to give each of my friends a compact mirror as well, but they didn't have any. But when I went in today, they had some new ones in and these ones have just the letter on the front. I was very lucky to find everyone's initial. So I have two C ones, then I have an M and an E. And I'm really excited to add these in to the little gift boxes that I'm giving each of the girl guests that are coming to our wedding. So yeah, I thought these were a really nice addition. And again, they just look really nice. So they're almost like a faux leather on the outside and they have the nice gold detailing. And they also open really nice as well. They are magnetic and yeah they feel lovely and these were £1.99 each I think. Okay then next up I picked up this eye roll-on product. It's an under eye serum 
and it says it cools, it refreshes, and it helps to like de-puff. Um, and I have noticed recently, I do get very puffy, especially when I've been drinking. I've noticed now that alcohol, I can actually see the effects of it after I've been drinking. Like the night before the morning I wake up, I look in the mirror and I can just tell that I've had a few drinks. And we are definitely going to be having a few drinks over this wedding. So I thought this would be really nice to just pop on in the morning to try and help de-puff my under eyes. And also, I think this product was something like, maybe it was meant to be 12 99 or something like that. It's from the brand Biovene, Bioven, Biovene from Barcelona. And how much did I pay for this? So I only paid £1.99, so it definitely was worth more than that. Um, but this is what it looks like here in the packaging and it says it's hyaluronic acid and I just want to see if it's got a little metal, oh it's nice, it's got a metal ball on the end. I love it when they have metal balls because that just feels so cooling under the eye. Oh it feels really nice, it's a very very lightweight serum. It's unscented actually, which is probably quite good when you're putting it around your eyes, it's not going to sting or anything. But it feels lovely and cool and it's just a very very thin texture. So yeah, this will be really nice in the mornings when I'm like, oh my god, what happened last night? I can just lay in bed and just like roll this around my eyes and just try and feel alive again, ready for the next night of drinking. We are going to be having three nights in Vegas prior to our wedding. So you can imagine there's going to be partying, there's going to be cocktails, there's going to be dancing. So yeah, this should come in very handy. Okay, next up, I do actually have loads of cleansers already at the moment. I've suddenly got a little bundle of them and I'm just getting through them all. But I spotted this one and I thought, actually, this sounds like something I'd really like. So I'm just going to pick it up and I'm not going to start using it until I've used all the other ones up. I do think I'm going to like this one. I, gen I generally like a thick gel cleanser that foams up as you put it in onto your face. Uh, this is the L'Oreal Paris Hyaluron Expert Replumping Purifying Gel Wash. And it says it rehydrates, smooths and deeply purifies your skin. Uh, and it's got hyaluronic acid in it. And it's all skin types, even sensitive. And I think the reason I like this is because it is purifying, but it's also plumping. And I'm hoping that this is gonna really cleanse my skin because I love a deep foamy cleanse, but I hate that dry stripped feeling. So I'm thinking because this is replumping, it might help with that kind of dry feeling. And also having the hyaluronic acid in it is gonna really help with moisturizing the skin. So I shouldn't get that really dry tight feeling. It actually says skin is replumped with moisture and feels renewed. Um, so it said that this was originally, what did it say? I think it was, 7 99 something like that. And I got it for £3.49, so I suppose almost like half price. Just wanna see if it smells of anything. Oh, it's a really nice thick gel texture. I think I'm gonna like this one. Ooh. Oh, I didn't think it was gonna be scented. I know scented stuff is probably not the best thing for your skincare, but I do love something when it smells good. It just makes the whole experience of using it just feel really nice. So this smells, how, how can I describe this? It smells very clean, but then also floral. Do you know what I mean? Fresh and floral, I would describe that as. Mmm, I really like that. So I will be looking forward to trying that one out. Okay, next up I have some Lenore Tumble Dryer Sheets. Um, in the scent Spring Awakening. This has been making the whole bag smell so strong. Like in the car, I was like, what can I smell? And it's these, and they're even, I've not even opened them. So they're, they're very strong. I can smell them through this little gap here. They smell so good. Um, so the plan with these is, my wedding dress is obviously gonna be packed to take away. And because we actually bought my wedding dress back in 2019, I got engaged in 2018 and my mum bought me my wedding dress in 2019, so like before COVID and all of that, when we thought that we'd be getting married a lot sooner. Um, so long story short, I've had the wedding dress a long time. It's been stored in my wardrobe. When I got it out to put it on, now we've actually planned a wedding and stuff and wear it, it smells. It smells moldy. <laughs> kind of I don't know what, it musty. It smells musty, moldy. It just doesn't smell fresh. And obviously I'm, I'm not gonna wash it. I'm not gonna get it dry cleaned or anything. Cause I just, 
I do not want to risk the dress at all. So one of my clients actually said to me, why don't I pop in some tumble dryer sheets when I pack it in the bag that I'm gonna take it in to go away? And I thought that is a great idea. And I'm actually just gonna put these through all of my clothes as well. So I'm just gonna lay a few of these throughout my luggage and my wedding dress is gonna be packed in a separate like wedding dress bag thing that I can carry on the plane with me. Um, so I will pop one or two of these in there, not directly on the dress, I'm gonna wrap it in tissue paper and then put these in there somewhere so it's not like touching it. But yeah, I just thought that was a great idea and then I will smell like clean washing hopefully and not like mold. I'm also gonna put loads of perfume on as well because you know when your clothes smell of mold or musty, it's really strong, isn't it? And if you go near somebody and their clothes smell musty, you can smell it straight away, can't you? And I thought, can you imagine I get up to Ollie and we're just about to get married and all he's thinking is, Ooh, she stinks. <laughs> I just thought, no, I don't want that. So hopefully these are gonna help me out. Talking about stinking, I have picked up this little mist. Um, this is called the Lou Mist. It's spray, seal and go, coastal breeze, toilet bowl spray. So this is basically like a cheaper dupe of the VI Poo, the VI Poo, uh, Poo spray, which you spray in the toilet before you go and do your business and then it just makes everything smell nice, nobody knows what you've done. And yeah, I do usually have these dotted around the house, I just feel like they're nice as air fresheners anyway, they just smell very strong. Um, but I thought I'd try out the Home Bargains dupe one of this, I mean it's called Loomis, it's probably its own brand, but I've not seen it anywhere else before. But I think this was only 79p. Oh, the tumble dryer sheets were 199 This was 99p, and this smells really nice. It says it's got 300 sprays in it, which is 100 uses. Um, and it's coastal breeze and yeah, it just smells. I know you're not gonna have to smell it, but I just like to spray it and then I can describe it to you. Oh, it smells almost a bit like linen, that fresh linen smell, but then with a little bit of like toilet cleaner mixed in, it just smells really good. And yeah, I'm gonna keep this in my handbag for when we're away, just because you know when you're out all day and you've got to go to public toilet, if you've got to go, you've got to go. I also haven't, this is a real side note, um, I also suffer with irritable bowel syndrome, which is IBS. And when I go away, I think it's like anxiety, change of routine, anything like that um, really can set it off. And I do not want to feel unwell on my wedding day because it can make me feel quite unwell if, if I'm out of my routine. Like I, without giving you too much detail, I need to go where I need to go, okay? And because I'll be all out of routine, the time difference is gonna completely throw me, I know that when I'm out and about, I may need to go. <laughs> and I'm being very honest with you guys here. Um, I'm sure everybody struggles with these sort of issues, so it's probably good that I'm talking about it and we are all very much the same. So, yeah, I do get a little bit of like embarrassed and I'm like, oh my God, I can't go in a public toilet, I can't do it, I can't do it. Um, but this is very helpful because, you know, it just means that when you leave the toilet, it's nice and fresh for the next person and you feel a little bit less embarrassed. So that is why I've picked up that one. I don't think I needed to give you all of that detail, but I have done anyway. Okay, I've picked up a couple of packs of floor wipes. Um, I do always grab a pack of these when I'm in home bargains and I just like them for a really quick clean when something just needs a, a quick spruce up. I love them. They're really nice big wipes and they're only 89p a pack, I think. Oh no, 59p, bargain. So yeah, 59p a pack and you get 15 wipes in each. And in my opinion, the apple one smells the best. Okay, next I have got some spray bleach. I do really, really like spray bleach when I'm doing a very deep clean. And while me and Ollie are away, we do actually have people staying in our house, looking after the dogs and looking after the house. And obviously it's more security and stuff. So we do actually have people coming to stay in the house. Um, so I'm gonna be doing a very deep clean. And yeah, if I'm doing a deep clean, spray bleach, I do go for it, it's just really good. And also if you have any like mold patches around the shower, you can spray this, pop a little cotton pad over the top of it. You can do this with neat bleach as well. Put the cotton pad over the top of it, leave it overnight, and then in the morning remove the cotton pads and normally all of the kind of moldy mark areas you get on the silicone seals um, are all gone. So yeah, I do love using this for a deep clean. How much was this? £2.49. Next up, I've just bought some bin liners. These are the vanilla fragranced ones. I haven't actually tried the vanilla. I normally get the lemon ones. I fancied a change. Ooh. 
do you know what they, they just smell like that i know what they smell like that's why i've gone oh because it reminds me of dog poo because our dog poo bags smell like this so immediately when i smell that i think of dog poo which is probably not the way it's supposed to go but anyway um these are very cheap i think they're 79p and you get 40 in here and it is quite nice they're scented but i would say if you're going to buy them go for the lemon ones they do smell better than these Okay, next I have some sun cream because at the moment in Vegas it is 45 degrees, which is just ridiculous. We've got two more weeks, so let's hope that the temperature drops a little bit. We are getting married on the Grand Canyon, which is colder than Vegas, hence why we're still going in the sort of summertime because we wanted it to be warm enough on the Grand Canyon at sunset for our wedding. But still, we have got those three days in Vegas and we've got some time afterwards. It's gonna be bloody hot. So, sun cream is definitely a necessity. And I do love this one by Hawaiian Tropic because it is the luminosity one. So it does have this very slight glimmer, gleam to it. I do have another one that I'm gonna take with me as well, which I've forgotten the name of it now. It's very nice. It's a shimmery sun cream and it's extra shimmery compared to this one. Um, so I will take both because I've started using that one already and I haven't got enough left to last me, I don't think. So I thought I'd get this as a top up because this one is very affordable, £4.49. I think they're normally £11.99 though, but in home bargains, £4.49. I've got mine in SPF 30, but you can also get it in SPF 15 and SPF 50. But yeah, the luminosity one is really nice because it just makes your skin look very glowy. I also love to wear this sunscreen for an evening out just to make my skin look really glowy like it works lovely on the chest to give you that nice glow even if I'm not going to be in the sun yeah I just like the way it makes my skin look so yeah I really recommend that one for just a general cream as well okay next up we have some toilet what how do you even what do you even call these toilet what are they called they're just these aren't they just toilet hanger things. I don't even know what these are called. But you know, you hang them in the toilet, you flush, and it just sends a little bit of product around the bowl. And yeah, they just make the toilet seem really clean. So I did pick up these two here. It's a two pack and it was £2.39. Also says it lasts 300 flushes. Okay, next up I have my absolute favourite facial self-tanner and it is the St. Moritz Face and Body Tanning Mist in shade medium. This stuff is so good if you just want to have a little bit of tan on your face. I put it on at night, I wake up in the morning and my skin just looks a little bit glowy. It has slight colour to it, it's not too dark, it wears off nicely. You can kind of do it every other night just to keep your face, have a little bit of tan and it evens out your skin tone. I've used so, so many different facial tanners but I always go back to this one. It's £3.99. And it is so good. Like I've tried way more expensive ones. And yeah, I do just go back for this one all the time. Um, I also use it to spritz my hands as well. So if I do a full body tan with like a mousse or a gel or something like that, I won't put that on my face. I like to use this on my face. And then I also use it to spritz my hands as well because your hands are always really hard to tan, aren't they? Whereas this just gives you a really lovely even tan. And it is just so affordable. And also this does last you quite a while as well. You can also use this all over your body. It has hydrating aloe vera in it. And it does. In the morning, you can feel your skin feels like nice and plump and hydrated. So yeah, one of my absolute favourite go-to products, which I will always continue to repurchase. And then last up, I just picked up this little hairspray to take away with me. Because my hairspray I've got here is just absolutely massive. So I just wanted a little one to take away. I actually don't use hairspray that much because I don't like the feel of it in my hair, but I know that I'm gonna be doing a few different hair cells and stuff and we are probably gonna need some hairspray. So I thought I'd just grab this little one. Um, it's the Tresemme Freeze Hold 24 Hour Frizz Control. Oh, I like the idea it's frizz control actually. Um, but yeah, hopefully this one will last us. How much was this? This was £1.19. So guys, that is everything from my Home Bargains haul. I really hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, please give the video a thumbs up because that really helps out my channel. And I hope you guys are doing very well. And thank you so much for watching. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.